Basin Manager with the Sea Turtle Conservation and Research Program at Moat. Uh, today is April 15th, and so that means it's the start of our sea turtle nesting survey patrols. We are out here despite the county beach closures. We've been granted permission from the county um, to continue to uh, do our monitoring this year. Um, we are practicing our social distancing and uh, CDC guidelines for the COVID-19. Um, as you can see, I'm pretty isolated out here uh, as it is, but just in case, I did bring my mask in case I need to interact with anybody while I'm out here. So a lot of people want to know why we do these nesting surveys and, and why they're important. Um, in Sarasota County, we don't have quite as many nests as there are seen on the Atlantic coast of Florida, but Sarasota County has the highest density of the Gulf Coast of Florida. So we're still pretty dense as far as sea turtle nests go, and um, we want to make sure that their populations continue to do well despite challenges they may face, such as uh, disappearing habitat, uh, climate change, pollution, all that stuff. So we are out here um, as part of our normal every year routine uh, to collect our nesting survey data and see how our Sarasota County sea turtles are doing. This year is going to be a little unique uh, just because we're starting the season in the middle of this uh, world pandemic uh, with COVID-19 uh, and the uh, stay at home order issued uh, for the state of Florida. But we are going to continue as much as we can uh, doing normal nesting surveys um, through this and we hope it won't last too long and we hope everyone out there stays safe um, including all of our wonderful volunteers and interns and all of you at home. Um, please stay safe, follow the guidelines, and um, the turtles will be out here nesting, so we'll keep you updated.